Explanation of SCR, Silicon Controlled Rectifier A silicon controlled rectifier, SCR, is a type of semiconductor device that functions as a controlled switch. It is a four-layer solid-state device that controls current. The SCR is a type of thyristor, which is a larger family of semiconductor devices designed to act as bistable switches, conducting when their gate receives a current trigger and continuing to conduct while they are forward biased. Structure An SCR is a four-layer semiconductor device with alternating P-type and N-type layers, forming a PNPN structure. It has three junctions, J1, J2, and J3. The SCR has three terminals. Anode, A connected to the outer P-type layer. Cathode, K connected to the outer N-type layer. Gate, G connected to the inner P-type layer near the cathode. Internal construction, Anode, P-type this is the positive terminal. Cathode, N-type this is the negative terminal. Gate, P-type this terminal is used to trigger the SCR. 3PN junctions. Junction J1, between the anode, P-type, and the adjacent N-type layer. Junction J2, between the two inner layers, P-type and N-type. Junction J3, between the cathode, N-type, and the adjacent P-type layer. Operation. The operation of an SCR can be understood by examining its behavior in different modes. Forward blocking, forward conducting, and reverse blocking. 1. Forward blocking mode. Condition. Positive voltage is applied to the anode relative to the cathode, but no gate current is applied. Behavior. Junctions J1 and J3 are forward biased, but junction J2 is reverse biased, preventing current flow through the SCR. The SCR remains in the off state, blocking the current. 2. Forward conducting mode. Condition. Positive voltage is applied to the anode relative to the cathode, and a small positive gate current is applied to the gate terminal. Behavior. The gate current injects carriers into the P-type layer near the cathode, reducing the width of the depletion region at junction J2. This triggers the SCR into conduction. Once triggered, junction J2 becomes forward biased, allowing a large current to flow from the anode to the cathode. The SCR remains in the on state even if the gate current is removed, as long as the anode current is above the holding current level. 3. Reverse blocking mode. Condition. Negative voltage is applied to the anode relative to the cathode. Behavior. Junction J1 is reverse biased, while junctions J2 and J3 are forward biased. The SCR remains in the off state, blocking the current flow. The device can withstand a high reverse voltage up to its rated value. Switching characteristics. Turn on time. The time interval from the application of the gate pulse to the instant the SCR starts conducting fully. Turn off time. The time required for the SCR to switch from the conducting state to the blocking state after the anode current falls below the holding current. Key parameters. Latching current, INRS, the minimum anode current required to maintain the SCR in the on state immediately after it has been turned on and the gate current has been removed. Holding current. I understand the minimum anode current required to keep the SCR in the on state. If the anode current falls below this value, the SCR will turn off. Practical considerations. Gate triggering. The gate current should be applied for a short duration, pulse, to trigger the SCR, and then it can be removed. Heat dissipation. Proper heat sinking is essential to dissipate the heat generated during conduction and prevent thermal runaway. Symbol. The symbol of an SCR is depicted with an anode, A, cathode, K, and gate, G. The arrow in the symbol indicates the direction of conventional current flow when the SCR is in the conducting state. Markdown. Copy code. Anode dash cathode. Gate. By controlling the gate current, SCRs can be used in a variety of applications that require switching and power control. Silicon controlled rectifiers, SCRs, find extensive use in various applications where controlled switching of high power loads and precise regulation of electrical signals is necessary. Here are some common applications of SCRs. Power control. Light dimmers. SCRs are used in light dimming circuits to control the brightness of incandescent lamps and other lighting fixtures by varying the phase angle of the AC voltage applied to them. Heater control. SCRs regulate the power supply to electric heaters by adjusting the conduction angle of the AC waveform, thereby controlling the amount of heat generated. Motor speed control. In industrial applications, 
SCRs regulate the speed of AC motors by adjusting the voltage or frequency applied to them. Rectification Controlled rectifiers SCRs are used in rectifier circuits to convert AC voltage into DC voltage with controlled output characteristics. They are particularly useful in applications where precise regulation of DC voltage and current is required. Voltage regulation Voltage stabilizers SCRs are employed in voltage regulation circuits to stabilize the output voltage supplied to sensitive electronic devices and equipment. Switching circuits Switching power supplies SCRs are used in switching power supply circuits to efficiently convert AC voltage to DC voltage with high reliability and minimal power loss. Relay and contactless switching SCRs can replace mechanical relays in applications where frequent switching is required providing faster response times and longer operational life. Protection Devices Over-Voltage Protection SCRs are used in crowbar circuits to protect electronic circuits and devices from over-voltage conditions by short-circuiting the power supply when the voltage exceeds a safe threshold. Over-Current Protection SCRs can be used in circuit breakers and current limiters to protect against excessive current flow that could damage electrical equipment. Pulse Circuits Pulse Generators SCRs are utilized in pulse circuits to generate precise and controlled pulses of electrical signals for applications such as timing circuits, pulse width modulation, PWM, and triggering other electronic devices. Industrial Control Systems Process Control SCRs play a crucial role in industrial automation and process control systems, where they are used to regulate heating elements, control actuators, and manage power distribution in manufacturing processes. High Power Applications High Voltage DC Transmission SCRs are employed in high voltage direct current HVDC, transmission systems to control the conversion and transmission of electrical power over long distances with minimal losses. Telecommunications Telecommunication Equipment SCRs are used in telecommunications equipment for signal switching and amplification, ensuring reliable and efficient operation of communication networks. Consumer Electronics Consumer appliances. SCRs are integrated into household appliances such as electric stoves, water heaters, and air conditioners to regulate power consumption and improve energy efficiency. In summary, SCRs are versatile semiconductor devices that provide efficient and reliable solutions for controlling power and signals in a wide range of industrial, commercial, and consumer applications, contributing significantly to energy management, automation, and electrical safety. Here are a few examples of commonly used SCRs, each with its own specifications and applications. 2N5060 Type Sensitive Gate SCR Application Used in low-power switching applications, such as small motor controls, light dimmers, and various consumer electronics. BT151 Type Medium Power SCR Application Widely used in light dimming circuits, motor speed control, and power switching applications where moderate current handling capabilities are required. C106D Type General Purpose SCR Application Found in a wide range of consumer electronics and industrial control systems for switching and power regulation purposes. TIN612 Type High Current SCR Application Suitable for high power applications such as industrial motor controls, power supplies, and heating control systems where significant current handling capabilities are necessary. MAC 97A6 Type Triac, a type of bidirectional SCR. Application Used in AC switching applications, such as phase control, light dimming circuits, and small AC motor speed controllers. BT169D Type Sensitive Gate SCR. Application Typically used in low power switching applications timing circuits, and control systems where precise triggering and small current requirements are advantageous. These examples showcase the versatility of SCRs in different power handling capacities and applications, from small consumer electronics to high-power industrial equipment. The choice of SCR depends on factors such as current rating, voltage rating, triggering characteristics, and specific application requirements for controlling and switching electrical power effectively. SCRs are crucial components in many electronic circuits due to their ability to control high voltages and currents with precision. Their robustness and reliability make them suitable for a wide range of industrial and consumer applications.